la 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 la. When will I play God of War? I don't know. La 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 la. La 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 la. Oh, I need the sap. The sap. No, no, like get it off. No, 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 no. Get off the thing. See? 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 You can follow instructions, Kratos. Aren't you impressed by yourself? Eh, screw it. I love that. I feel like Superman whenever I die. Give me a sec, boys and girls. felt sticky that was actually pretty cool oh. <laughs> almost missed you did I miss something back there I feel like I missed something back there Let's just double check. Oh no, I already did that. Okay. Bro, the last of us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Boy, over here. Yes, sir. Okay. Can phase through solid matter. Is Hold one on. of let me read this. One of the Leviathan acts. Many abilities. I'm quite envious of it. It's getting colder. We must be near the top. We must be, huh? Well, you know what? We must it's not be. Not long now, Mark. broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. Broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Find your footing. Okay. That's gone forever. Enemies ahead! <laughs> oh my. Just, just let it happen. Let it Hold happen. On! Let it happen. Just, just, just let it happen, man. I've been trying for a while now. You know, ever since I saw your mom with the Leviathan axe. 
I mean, in the light of Alfheim, I've just been, just been a little bit sad and out of it, and it's just. Ready up, boy. <laughs> Who the f That's not what I meant to do. Yeah, you do that. Potential boy. I'm not sure if that would be, be like a compliment. Because um you have potential boy. Does that mean that you didn't think I had potential before? Or like it's uh, what's going on there? Oh, is it only now I have potential? Oh, can't use that either. We'll see about that boy. It's in the game for there a reason. Must be some way up. Obviously. You hear those voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. Tell me. You know why we're here. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. I see you brought company this time. It must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me. You two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! Okay. When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? <laughs> That's hilarious. What the heck? It's a pretty good drawing. Not gonna lie to you. Pretty good drawing. Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. Well, we took their path. Make sure we're all alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. Sir. Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just give him time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard, it's in Jotunheim. Realm of the Giants. 
No! I Calm yourself. What she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body through these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the hey. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This. This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Brother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy, the longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Uh, so you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Good enough. My God, his head really just. Yuna, we're going to Yuna. We're going to find the long lost realm of the giants. That's. That's. Inconvenient. Yeah, that's just what I was going to say. <laughs> Shut your ass up. Boy. Oh, you and I will be able to go to Muspelheim. It's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Do you remember the way to the witch's house? Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Good. Hope she made it back from Alfheim and can bring me in. You seem nice. Before you cut off his head. I enjoyed that part. Oh, I can just go back to the, um, yeah. Yeah. I can just, uh, go back to the, uh, you know, the, uh, the thing, you know? What the heck am I watching? Chopped? Chopped Casino Royale. Man, I just want to go. Ah. All right. Oh, a Sindri's thing. After I resurrect, um, what's his name? We'll probably do that. Probably. I can't believe it was Balder that came to our house. The Acer God, Balder, and you fought him and won. Yes. One of Odin's sons, Thor's brother, and now he's hunting us with his nephews. 
Why is this happening? If we can raise the head, you can ask him. Okay. You know, it's silly. Oh, okay. But I secretly hope we find a giant somewhere in that mountain. I guess they really did leave Midgard, except for the serpent. Maybe the last of his kind. Are you the last of your kind too? Is that why you don't like to talk about my the... kind? I mean, your family. Before mother and I. Where you came from. Mother, a father? Now is not the time for that. Yes, sir. <gasps> Whoa. Hey, I know that guy. Rock! 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 What? I'm on a fucking break. Don't hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No, Beth. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you'll let him go and roger my axe good and plenty again. Hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Hmm. Well enough. I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? <laughs> Times he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has it the sense to sip or suck. And if he does remember, good luck getting him to cook his own meat. Guess I got all the stomach in the family. <laughs> You're along with the smarts. You miss uh. What, that spit fister? What do you know? I just mean hey, that... Do you mind? Trying to concentrate here? Already on a break from my break. <laughs> Alright. Alright, you got it, bro. You got it. You got it. Boy, what is the path back to the witch? First, we need to find a boat. That is not what I meant to happen. Do you remember the way back to the witch from here? That way, behind the big statue of Thor. Like, like that way, or like, okay, that way. No, it's not that way. No. Know any good stories to pass the time? What kind of story? I don't know. Mother always had stories. Weren't you told me when you were a boy? There was a man I knew a long ago. His stories were brief and purposeful. Sounds fun. Do you remember any? Huh. There was one that concerned a hare and a tortoise. Like the witch's house? Unlikely. So what happens? They wager on a race between them. The hare is too confident of victory and foolish, while the tortoise is steady and disciplined. I've heard this before. The tortoise wins. You haven't told a lot of stories, have you? Isn't silence just the best? I'm not talking, you're not talking. You can dock the boat here. Serpent rose. Right. I knew that. Did you? Because you didn't seem to, um. 
Oh, perfect. I know she's really powerful, but you really think the witch can bring a head back to life? She seems competent in her craft. Witchcraft. Have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life, can we keep the head? No. But you may feed it to the fish. Okay. Damn, bro. Damn. Ah, oh, I forgot to upgrade my armor. Yo, what's the goal with her, bro? Talking about some yeah. Sounds like she's about to die. Oh, what's this? Hey, this does more than decipher those Muspelheim runes. It also contains the travel room. Should we go visit? Shut up, boy. I bet this will lead out. Yeah, I'm not trying to lead out, you know? But, like, if you really want to, we can go out there some other time, you know? I mean, we're already here. So me, Atreus. Ah, crap. Do we have to go out? Can I just... Can I just... Can I just... Can I just... Because, like... Oh, I have to go out. Alright. Fine, 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 fine. Whatever you say. Boy, what does that say? Turn back, Aesir. Guess the gods are welcome here. <gasps> there he is! I hope he remembers us. That was a pretty good guess. Edible? They're not talking about weed, are they? They can't be. Interesting. What does it say? Oh, fine. Don't tell me. Who's gonna feed you tonight? Mm -hmm. How's it going, Charlie? Is your witch friend here? What is that name? <laughs> That's what he told me it was. Or what it sounded like in my head anyway. Charlie. I don't know, what, what does Kratos have against Charlie, bro? I like that name, Charlie. Hit him with the... Hit him with
I'm getting better. Enemies down. I'm getting way. Oh man, my mirror is just getting blacker by the second. Lucky there's no police here. <laughs> that was a joke. Father, she is here. What the hell? It's so good to see you again. Really? I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what. Wait, where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. <sighs> now, what's this about a head? Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. <laughs> he claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? How is she not on fire right now? Like Take her him feet? To the table. A little too close. Hey, Mille. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well. Thankfully, his head hasn't decayed much, and his brain is still intact. <sighs> nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water, and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. Hey, he's he back. Worked. Let me see him. Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. Damn. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the witch in the woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either? Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you Ye really going to lecture me about that? Word. You don't get to criticize. We are leaving, boy. What? Now. You're welcome. <laughs> Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value the privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel, head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Who better to tell us the way? The World Serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? It's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. In your face. No. Speak of Balder. He claims nothing harms him. Aye, Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. 
Did I? What is the source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved uh, a spell? Mamir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. I hope he's not broken. near the bridge. Mimir, you never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Bro, really? Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore, but a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? Mm. Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined Enough. to find a more enlightened path. Enough. No stories. Not while on foot. Our focus is the road. Completely understood. Ed, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. Finally! That horn! <laughs> What was that thing that I just got? I forgot how to do that skill. How do you do it? While barehanded. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool. Good. Now put my lips to the horn. That statue made in honor of Thor. And seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. Our only concern is your name. All right, wish me luck. What you mean, wish me luck? Remembers me. Why you? Oh, no, that's not right. Eh. Mokuno Huntunku. What is it? Oh, 
nothing to be concerned about. What is he doing? Making sure we're headed in the right direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Is that one of the peak where we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Of course. Luckily, I know where it is. And it's not far. He looks kind of mad for a moment. Now that, you thought I said you were friends of Odin. You'll forgive me. I've never spoken the ancient tongue sober. <laughs> Wait, look! The water's dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. Damn, that's a big-ass serpent. 